Hi guys, it's your girl A. Marie from A. Marie Full Lace Wig. I wanted to uh, bring some of my work to you guys' attention. This is one that I'm working on, and this one is a piano blend. I'm in a process of blending the colors. This one is the piano blend. And then it is full lace, so it has the scratch right here, and then a lace in the back, so I'm working on it. And just kind of giving you guys an idea, like, um, when I make my wigs, I use my bigger needle for the back. That's what's going to give you the heavy density. And then when I get to the front, I drop down to a smaller needle. But one thing I don't do, guys, um, I don't use a zero-op needle. I don't drop down to a a one-to-one -one strand needle. So that's kind of what they do over with their wigs in China. I don't make my wigs like they do in China. I give a uh, medium to heavy density. And if you want light density, I drop down to even smaller needle. But I don't make them real, real thin, 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 baby, 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 fine uh, hairs in there toward the front. I don't do that. So, excuse me, if you guys are looking for that, um, don't order from me. Those are not the type of wigs that I make. You have to actually glue my wig down, put it on to see, you know, the results in it. So, my method of making my wigs is totally different. Um, if you're looking for the super fine, really, really, really thin, thin, thin uh, hair being added into the wig, I suggest you order from China. Do not order from me. I make my wigs to last you longevity, meaning that it'll last you years with proper maintenance. I don't make my wigs for, uh, what, two to three months, and you can't wear it anymore because the hair is very, very thin, and it breaks. So in order for you to see what my wig look like on, you literally literally have to uh, glue it down. If you don't glue it down, you're not going to see the magic. Okay, guys, the camera cut off, but um, like I said, I don't make my wigs like that. So I think that sometimes people get it confused. They compare my work to the wigs that they get from China, and then when they get it, they're disappointed. Like, oh, hey, Marie, you know, they want it super, super fine, and um, I don't do that. Where's my comb? So, in order to see the magic in my wig, you literally will have to glue it down. You know, you literally will have to glue this wig down, and then you will see the magic in it. If you don't glue it down and just look at it, you know, you'd probably be like, oh, it's not going to look right. But in order to see the magic in it, you can see with it glued down, um, it parts. I have the ability to, you know, part the unit, and then I use about eight ounces of hair on this unit. I use about eight ounces of hair on this unit, so, I mean, you know, uh, you do have to, you know, work with it. Sometimes I have my sealer on there, and the hair won't move right away. I always tell people, take the hand sanitizer and put it through, and then, you know, that'll, that'll make the, the wig part, you know, a lot better, but... Um, like I say, it's time for my unit to come off, so it's starting to lift a little bit. But, uh, like I say, it'll lay really, really fine here, guys, but I don't make those thin, 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 thin hairlines. So, if you guys are looking for that, that's not what I do. That's not what I do. That's not what I do. So, I would tell you guys, do not, do not, do not uh, order from me. I don't use zero ops or one needle where you're getting like uh, them real, real little bitty, little bitty strands of hair. That's not what I do. I do my method totally different. So, I don't want nobody to be confused. Um, like I said, this is one that I'm working on. And like I said, this one is very full. This is a repeat customer. She shot with me before, so she kind of knows, uh, you know, what my units is like. So she knows what my units is like when she get it. I'm working on another one. Hold on. Let me get up, and I'll get that one and show that one to y'all. Okay, this is another one that I'm working on. And like I said, she wants hers to be full density, too. And like I said, this is the back of it. I started it. Like I said, it does have the scratch in the middle. And like I said, she wanted heavy density, so I'm using a bigger needle. And like I said, you know, this is, you know, how pretty much how I do my units, guys. I give you the fullness so you can wind up with, uh, with uh, five ounces in the back. 
in six, seven, eight, three ounces in the front because I dropped down to a smaller needle. So again, for those people that, you know, is, is interested in those super fine, you know, uh, hairlines with very, very, very little hair going around the front, you don't see the realistic in my wigs until you literally glue it down. I do not make my wigs like they do over in China. So again, if that's what you're looking for, don't compare my work to China. I don't make my wigs like they do over in China. I'm self-taught. My method is totally different. The way I'm doing it is my way, the A. Marie way. So if you guys are not interested in that, please, please, please do not order. Do not order. Do not order from me. I don't do that. So I'm not going to give you, you know, some people be wanting them really, really thin, 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 like zero op hairlines i don't do that so that's not what i do so if that's what you guys looking for um order from different vendors uh, if you want heavy to medium to full density for your wig to last you years with proper maintenance that's kind of what i do so i'm tired of you know newcomers that come to me that have never ordered a wig for me and then they're looking at my work because hey marie this don't look like what i'm used to getting don't compare my work to china because that's not what i do everything i do is special made down from like I say, from the caps that I make, everything is made by me from me customizing a cap for you guys to um, putting the mash in there to working the density out. So everything I do is custom, custom made. So I don't, I do not, again, make my wigs like China. If that's what you guys is looking for, please do not order from me. That's not what I do. So I just wanted to give a... Uh, a more definition of what I do because you get new people that come to me that want a wig and then when they get it they seem disappointed feeling like oh this is not what I'm looking for so if you're not looking for the fullness the heaviness uh, a wig to last you longevity and like I said if you can see my wig is flat to my head you do not see the knots when it's put down I do not bleach knots or none of that so in order for you guys to see the magic in the unit that I make you you have to glue it down you have to put it on so I just want to give you guys more info about what I do if you're looking for very light fine 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 hairs that's not what I do so thank you guys for watching a Marie full lace wigs God bless guys bye bye